the boy hid his cell phone inside his grandfather's coffin. After the funeral, he dialed his grandfather's number and poured out his feelings of longing. The next morning, Craig was astonished to find a text message on the phone, seemingly incoherent letters as a response from his grandfather. He became convinced that his grandfather had been buried alive and needed to be rescued immediately. Craig shared this with his father, but his father dismissed it as a prank by hackers. Nonetheless, Craig went to his grandfather's gravesite and dialed his grandfather's number, then placed his ear to the ground. The sound of a ringing phone emanated from the grave, yet no one answered. That night, Craig called his grandfather's phone and told him that if he could hear to knock on the wall three times. After ending the call, Craig waited in silence. The walls remained untouched, but his phone rang. Afraid to answer, Craig waited until the call ended. Picking up the phone, he received another text message. Trembling, Craig dropped the phone to the ground. Slowly approaching it, he examined the screen and saw that the message was from his grandfather, consisting of the same incomprehensible letters. 